Hello everybody. So doing these videos, I have had a small problem with severe lag in editing, uh, the editing software. I've been using Filmora 9, which has been an all right experience so far. I have not had any troubles with the actual product. However, this little laptop, this Dell Inspirion 15, does not have enough RAM to keep up, so I end up with a lot of lagging as I'm editing, which causes a lot of frustration. So, what my wife has done for me for my birthday is she bought me a new stick of RAM. This is an eight gigabyte stick of RAM. The laptop only has four from the factory, so this is going to double my amount of RAM and hopefully lessen the frustration, the lagging, and all that jazzy fun stuff. So I figured I know I haven't posted a video in a little bit. That is because I work two jobs and right now I am pulling well over 70 hours a week between the two. So I haven't had time. However, this is going to be a very easy thing to do, a quick project. And I figured, hey, you know what? Let's throw that in there. So this is how to change the RAM in your laptop. Each laptop is going to be a little bit different. This one, this is the Dell Inspirion 15 3000 series is super simple. Nothing to it. And you are going to learn that right now. Without further ado. The first thing you're going to do is make sure you have it unplugged from the wall. You do not want any power coming in. That being said, you are going to want to remove your battery as well. Depending on your laptop, this could be different. Usually there's a little unlock tab here and an unlock tab here. One of them will stick in place, this one. The other one you will hold in place. And depending on your laptop, it's going to come out differently. Hopefully you know how because I am not a super techie guy. I'm a hands-on guy, not a techie guy. So this is semi-new to me as far as working on small electronics. However, it is not difficult. So you're gonna take your battery off. You now have zero power going to the device. Uh, depending on your laptop, you're gonna have several screws back in this panel. Some laptops, you're gonna to have to take the entire back off. Uh, this one, like I said, is super simple. You have one little screw right here. You're gonna pull that out. You're gonna set it aside and most likely lose it, but try not to. That's coming out. Now, you're just gonna grab this panel and pull it towards you. Uh, if for the first time it might be super stiff, you might have to get a screwdriver in here and wedge in and then pry it, pop it. I don't know if you can see that, but I have a little mark from doing that myself already. So you're going to pop that panel off and you will see right here, this is a little venting so that everything can cool off the RAM. Let's air out. Now, this right here is your RAM stick. Uh, let me see if I can zoom in. Okay, that is close as I can get, unfortunately. So you're gonna have two little tabs holding your RAM in. You just kind of pop them up and over to the side up and over to the side. It'll pop right out, you pull it out. Do not touch these parts. You do not want any hand grease on there. Set it aside, and I just heard my wife and boy pull up in the driveway. I'm gonna try and get this done quick before the little boy comes in yelling. And take your new stick, slide it right in. Latch it into place. You can now button it back up and uh, put it back together and you're done. So for us, that's this piece. Pop it in. Find that screw you you lost. It's a super small screw. See? Okay. I'm trying to hurry because I can hear my little boy walking up and it gets loud when he shows up. Put that in. You're good to go. Power up and enjoy. If you liked what you saw, give it a thumbs up. Whoa, I'm still zoomed in. Hold on. Let me try that again. Okay, let's try that again. If you liked what you saw, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more of what I do around the place, projects on the cars, on whatever I do, because I don't like paying other people to do my stuff, subscribe and you will see those videos. 
Thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day.